times did I say good morning now? <laughs> Hi. You're tired. Do you want to say hi? No? Okay. <laughs> Good morning. It's Wednesday today and it's really hot in Berlin. I'm trying to take it slow with work. All I have to do today is a painting of another plant. <laughs> but I want to have more plant stickers in my shop because I'm a sucker for plants as you might know and yeah I was just thinking to make more of them I can now let my inner plant lady out and then I thought I could make uh, because this video is gonna be I think it's gonna be very short and boring because I don't really have so much to do but I thought maybe I could um, make a little question and answer thing when I paint because I posted the question sticker thing on Instagram yesterday and I got so many questions and I can't really answer them all in my stories because I would just completely spam you guys <laughs> and this is... I don't want to do this and I thought I could maybe just answer it um, in a video I can do that while I paint Did I already tell you that I'm planning to make more plant stickers? I also want to pot this plant it's a it's a rubber plant i took it from this plant and it has a lot of um oh how do you say it roots Last time I did a studio tour, which was two weeks ago, <laughs> I already changed things again. I found these cups the other day and I thought they were perfect for these drawers and for the stickers. So I can just put them in here and just take them out. It's much easier than having it in the drawer that I had before. And then I also have a bag for all my washi tape because I need quite a lot for packing and then here I think this is the same just the pack pins are there now and not in the drawer the rest is still the same I also got another package yesterday with more stickers because one of the plant stickers was empty so I had to restock them I'm thinking to take a picture with all the stickers in the background and then one in the foreground um, so I can post it tonight on Instagram this is the one. I'm always happy when I have enough stickers. <laughs> so I was thinking to place the stickers like this. Like, like really a lot. Maybe a bit more. I don't know. <laughs> I never did this kind of picture. So maybe more like this. Like more crazy. Maybe even more. That is so cool. <laughs> I want to hold one like this can you please focus like this mm -hmm. this is the finished picture now you probably already saw it because i'm gonna post it tonight and i'm gonna post the vlog tomorrow i think um that i'm gonna start painting um i already did the sketches for all the designs that I want to have um, I can maybe show you so this is the painting for today 
Uh, I think I'm not going to show you all the designs that I planned because they're not done and I didn't paint them yet and maybe I'm going to change things so I don't want to show you things too early but I can show you the ones that I painted already. This is the one that I also already painted and this is the last one. So I had to charge the battery of the camera and in the meantime I made myself some lunch. This is just some lentils cooked um, and then mixed with spinach and sweet potatoes, some green peas, some chickpeas, some avocado, uh, what else? And the dressing is tamari sauce, miso paste and the juice of a lime and some maple syrup. I just finished my lunch and now I will start painting. I already traced the sketch onto this watercolor paper. Um, currently I use this one. Yeah, but I'm still trying out different brands. I think I'm gonna answer your questions while I paint, but I will record it as a voiceover because I'm not good in painting and talking and reading questions. Um, as far as the mixing goes, I already mixed my colors. Um, because I did the the two paintings before and I'm trying to use kind of the same colors for all of these. Let's go. Where do you get inspiration from when it comes to drawing and painting? I think most of the time my inspiration comes from my love for plants and healthy food so i don't know why i just naturally always gravitate towards drawing this or something related to it when i have time when i don't know what to draw which happens really often i look on pinterest and then i just draw whatever i like it doesn't have to look good i don't have to show it to anybody and then after quite a while i have something that i like and that i continue to make into a painting or something like that. How did you know you were ready and confident enough to start sharing your art? To be honest, I wasn't ready when I started. Um, I was really afraid, so I just started without telling anybody. Because for me it's always easier to try things out on my own first and then when I feel a little bit more confident, I feel ready to tell it to people. But I wasn't really afraid of showing my art to people on the internet that I don't know personally. So for me, it was just a thing with my friends and family. I was kind of shy to tell them that I do this. I still feel vulnerable today, but I really like to do what I love, regardless of what other people say. So in the end, I always know that I really enjoy what I do and I don't want to feel judged by other people. How do you deal with stress? I love your art, by the way. Thank you. That's a very good question because I always have my problems with stress. And even if there's no one pushing me to do anything, I still feel stress to push forward and do more and be better and it's just not good and not healthy so every time that takes over me i cannot properly breathe and since i work from home for myself i really try to allow myself to stop doing whatever i do or to just do like half days what helps me is doing something completely off topic from my job i do yoga i really love that um, i also try to do meditation sometimes i use the app called headspace it is amazing this is not sponsored but i really love the app i also love playing video games it helps me to get my mind off of things and to just be in the world of the game i don't really know how to describe this but i always feel like oh i can check something here i can check something there and i never really start working but i know it's very important to give myself a break every now and then to produce good work I think this is also because I enjoy my job so much. I always want to do something, but I know that I need my breaks. There are still so many questions left and I really want to respond to all of them, but it would just be too much for now. And maybe I can always include some questions in the videos, maybe while I paint like this one now. Let me know in the comments if you would like to see that and then I do it.
I was just outside on the balcony for a couple of minutes only because it is so hot outside. This is crazy. I came back in, took a shower and now I think I'm gonna start editing the vlog. I want to upload the video tomorrow evening and then we will go out for dinner today. We also found a new vegan ice cream shop. Uh, we found it four days ago and we've been there five times. Hello. You're so happy. He's always so happy because I just um, showered him because it's so hot outside so I sometimes just put him on the shower and he loves that he loves when I when he knows that I'm about to shower him he's freaking out he loves it <laughs> you happy so happy He loves water. What are you doing? <laughs> Wanna go out for a walkie? So we just got back home and now I will water the plants and after that I will edit the vlog a little bit and then go to bed.